after the ocean swallowed Atlantis. And before recorded history, there was an age when Mythical Kingdom spread across an uncharted world. This was the age of Khan. Enslaved as a boy, Khan grew into a warrior. He escaped to encounter mystery, magic, and myth, while forever facing the ultimate master of sorcery. Lover, friend, hero. There are six thieves on our horses. Thanks to the sleeping guard. No, wooden imp. It was you, Seven. It was Dandelion Wine that did its magic. Your wooden imp was a thief named Corella. Corella! So that's why you've been so volcanic. It's not just stolen horses, but who stole them? And now she's on her way to Arjun. The city of thieves. If not, it's not our fight. Those are our horses. Something wrong with this wind. There must be a rich prize in that cart. I'll be waiting for you. All that, and we still have to use our feet. Let's see what they are killing for. Beware, mortals. You look upon temple virgins. We are consecrated to the goddess, Zanata. Zanata? Despiser of men. And she has chosen you to be our champion. Oh. Well, there must be some mistake. See, we're just passing by. The goddess Zanata makes no mistakes. Magic. I hate magic. How will you escort us to Arangen without animals to pull the cart? The city of these? Arangen is no place for you. But we've been sent by our goddess to retrieve the talisman sacred to her. It's called Eye of Tasia. I'm not interested in magical objects. But you're going to Arangen anyway. To retrieve your horses. The ones stolen while you were asleep. And there's not for us to fear. With strong men like you to protect us. And helping us would please the goddess ever so much. Your goddess is not mine. The horses are. 
There would be a reward, of course, in addition to keeping it from His Azul. A reward? His Azul? His Azul wants its power. The goddess wants it for safety. My duty is to destroy His Azul's power. We will have to walk. We never walk. If I move the Black Legion to the north, I can block off all escape routes from the mountain. Yes, Master, but Colan does not seek escape. He seeks your death. But he is only one man. There are four altogether. And now he has added three great beauties to his group. He has three women with him. Virgins from Xandia. Then why was he rewarded and I was not? I'm not sure if it was in fact a reward. Fate is often unfair. I know. Hmm. I'm more concerned with my own pleasures. I don't wish to hear more whining about your existence. For what little I have, I remain somewhat grateful. I would, however, appreciate a small reward, a bonus. Be careful what you ask for. Do not overestimate your value. Would you consider some trading? Do not expect me to negotiate with a scum. You created me. You should deal with me. I saved you from oblivion for my use as a servant. And I serve you loyally, O oh Dark One. But could you not have saved more of me? Perhaps a small section of body, a leg, an arm or two? So that is your intention. Regain a body? Piece by piece, if possible. I have rubies I could return. And I have rubies more than enough to keep you as you are. You could have more, for your greed is a positive trait. So you now have ambitions to appear without a stipend? As you trained me, O oh Great One. Yes, so I have not done it well enough or your silence would have had the larger value. If you must speak, tell me more about Conan. I don't know anymore. He is guiding to the west. So, that's it? That is all you can tell me? It is, O oh Wondrous One. Well, that information is not even worth it. A toe is at least a start. No, but it is a finish. That is Arangen, City of Thieves. Ah, oh, it could do with a good washing. The ruler lives in that fortress. He is very evil. Indeed, he is, my lady. His name is Badad. How do you know him? Are you frightened by sorcerers, Atli? <laughs> Conan does not like them, but I'm Otley, the dragon too. Let us make haste. Yeah, yeah. Take care, Tidbit. Oh, look at his lovely muscles. Once we arrive, I shall soothe them with balm. Thank you. You want to go to the fortress? You walk. We must. It is Badad who possesses the Eye of Tasia, the talisman. Badad stole it from his Azul. Who stole it from our goddess? This is the way. anywhere. It will be in this place. You! A table at once! A clean one, please. 
Over there. You should not be seen. Uh, uh, I like to be seen. The goddess will protect us, and you too, if you do not anger her. Maybe she knows how we can get into his fortress. Only thieves would know such things. We are not thieves. The goddess, she knows your heart and your destiny. My destiny is to rid the world of his Azul. Your destiny is to bring us the Eye of Tasia. You goddess has picked the wrong man. <clears throat> I know a way into the fortress. You do? Shh. When I was a slave, I came to this fortress often. In the street of the gallows, there is an ancient well with a tunnel that leads beneath the fortress walls. If you go into that tunnel... We bring a nice drink here for the ladies. You little men, get out of here. No, little men. You get out, you. Get out of here. I'll follow. Another time. Oh, any time, darling. Oh, something bit me. Ah, there are bugs in here. There's soldiers out there. How much longer do we have to stay in here? Where's the wall? It's under the gallows. It's covered. By you. Stay here. Keep them quiet. We're being bitten. step. of our own foolishness. Carella, what a surprise. What are you doing here? You mean apart from almost rescuing you once more? If you hadn't stolen our horses, I wouldn't be here. It's what I do. I steal. I know that. 
Then why do you act so surprised? Can't you at least steal from enemies? I don't have to hate to do my job. And there's something else I came for. The gold lotus that holds the eye of Tosia. Sorry. Clever thief. You will help me catch your friend. Friend? No friend would steal from me. She stole from me! And you stole from his Azul. You fear him. And his power over you. Not enough to stop me. <laughs> to steal from his Azul. You must be very clever. How did you do this? <laughs> it is damaged. When his Azul found out that it was a copy, he was very angry. <laughs> what will he do when he discovers you got the wrong eye? That is one reason you will get the eye back for me. The other is... I need two fast horses. And my friend. Stay covered by the golden leaves, or it will become an extension of his Azul's sight. horse and yours Carella's trail Left the road. <laughs> Marg. I don't see Karen. Our horses are there. She must have sold them. That girl should be careful. To get my horses. Uh, 
Again. Get our horses? <laughs> How else to make you do your duty? <laughs> what duty? To free us, of course. Do you think you could just stroll by, sell a horse or two, and leave us here? Huh? <laughs> Even the horses we came with are flat. <laughs> Carella was here. She trade our horses for fresh ones. She was in a hurry to get to the port city of Matul. She can be there by nightfall tomorrow. Is she your woman? She's her own woman. Zevin! Stay. I will dance for you. I can. We are too far behind. It will be dark soon. I have to complete my task. Eh. Eh. There's a secret path through the forest to the sea. You leave here at dawn. You'll be in Matul by midday. Stay, Conan. Stay for me. <laughs> Evan. It is a whistle. Made from the tooth of a dragon. You wear it as an amulet for luck. <laughs> you will know when to use it. <sighs> we rescue people and they send us here. It is the smell of death. I don't like it either. But if we are to reach Mathur, He's 
Zazul created this monster. Who speaks the name he Zazul? Conan. His greatest enemy. You do not raise your sword against a mud monster. You raise it against Tisadul's brother! <laughs> we have a common enemy, Tisadul. But he's your brother? Yes, and my enemy. He created you? He creates only abomination and death. Even as children, he followed the path of darkness. But you did not. I gave myself to the light. That is why he blinded me, murdered me, and through his black arts trapped my spirit in this place of rot. Without my sight, I am condemned to this hellhole forever! You are blind? My vision, my very perception, were taken by magic and sealed in a great jewel. The Eye of Tosia. When a man, my name was Tosia. Tosia Zul. Even now we after this eye. Isa Zul does not have it. It was stolen by another, and a woman stole it from him, and now she's on her way to Mathu. If I possessed the eye, the evil spell that binds me to this world would be broken. We were told this was a way to Mathu. You are on it, and I will let you pass. As you believe in light and justice, bring back my life. When I catch sneak thieves, I usually kill them. You must have to commit suicide. Why? Because I stole the eye from that pig? <laughs> he stole it himself. <sighs> Too many people with power want it also. Impressive. I'm open to bids. It could be a dangerous auction. <laughs> what would you give me, Conan? I'll bring good money to the slave market in Mount Ah! If you live to get me there! And you will bring a few gold pieces too. Once I have tamed you. <laughs> you better kill me now. You make a fine slave, Conan. Eunuchs, you swear you are. <laughs> Not now. It's late. We must get to Mount before the ship leaves. You. I've seen you, quiet man. You belong to Conan. Zabeth, do not turn on me, or I will follow you for the rest of your life. You know a way? Lead me. You'll learn. Do not turn I will on me. Lead, and I will reward you. Anything you want. Do not turn on me. You can have her. Now, show me the shortcut. Get off me. This is it. Boom. Traitor! Oh. 
through here? You make no sense, Conan. You wish to return the eye of Tosazu, yet you're just willing to give it back to Badad. He has oddly buy you on three temple versions who are dedicated to the goddess. Yes! The goddess Sanat. I know, I know. But if the eye is so important to him, he should pay. If he lets you live, you can ask him. You don't have to come. You saved my life. I don't like debts. Anyway, someone's got to think for you. You were successful. Honor your promise and free these people. Yes, yes, of course. I see that you brought the thief as well. She's not a gift. I am more than willing to pay. <sighs> Hold. We have business here. Police them. Show me the eye. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> if you free this people, if you turn me into a sculpture, I will fall and the eye will shatter. Do it! The eye. Stop! Do not give the treasure to Badad! I am the Queen of Majesty. I ennoble men and give them purpose. Goddess Sonata. It was you from the beginning. Always it was I, for I have many aspects. I am the Queen of Majesty. I ennoble men and give them purpose. I am the Gentlewoman. I will feed you, soothe you, bear with you. I am pure delight, innocent joy. Play with me. I am the whore who tempts you. The hag who protects you with magic whistles. <laughs> the lover who thrills you. I am the warrior that fights at your side. When you let me, me. When you're at your best, my dear. Goddess, why is the eye of Tosia so important to you? Tosia Zul was far advanced along the path of light. I came to honor him for his beauty, his virtue, his nobility. He was the man to sit beside me. You loved him. But you could not help him against his brother. The evil spirit of Hisazul blinded his spirit to everything feminine. You see? And that is why he sank into the mud and became a monster. And I got a reputation for hating men. But eventually, I came to realize that to rescue Tosia, I would need a champion. A man. But me! 
What about me? Without the eye, I have no protection from his Azul. Attack! Attack! Kill them all! <laughs> have done well, Conan. Your courage gives me hope for your gender. <laughs> Will you come play with me one day? <laughs> yes. Come, sit by my fire. I will nourish you. Mm. Mm. You will have an honored place with us, always. All of you will. You promise a reward. Beyond measure, I think you said? And each time a woman looks on you with favor, you shall have it. But there is one more task. <laughs> a very pleasant task. A favor for a woman who loves. Please, return the eye to the sad man of mud and free the spirit of Tosizul from the curse. We will do as you ask. Man of mud. Perhaps your graces will have a bath ready for him? Where's Corella? Where is the Eye of Tasha? She took it. Why are you smiling? Corella took the wrong eye. <laughs> 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 Tazia Zul! Tazia Zul! Who calls the name of Tazia Zul? Conan! I know you, warrior! Enemy of my brother! As a goddess Granata requested, I have brought you the eye of Tazia. My gratitude, Conan, and to you all forever. When Corella finds out we tricked her with the Empty Blossom, she'll be mad for revenge. Don't worry. We have friends in high places now. An extra ruby is most generous of you, O oh Great One. Did you see what I saw? Toss your lips. I had no such vision, Master. I was resting. He was freed from his bondage by Conan. He has regained his eyes and his purpose. Even so, Tosia Jul is no match for you. Even as children, you overpowered I his do goodness. I not need another detractor, especially a brother who knows of my imperfection. Imperfection, sire? I did not know you had any such shortcomings. And you will not hear any now. As always, Invincible One, may I ask something? Um, if you must. Will you now be summoning me with an additional token? Two rubies instead of one? 
I would prefer my earlier request. It was an accident. One of them stuck to my finger. I would settle for a finger, a small one. Do you really think I would make you a person again? I would be an even stronger ally, sire. Or a more dangerous enemy. Is there nothing you'll add to me? Perhaps some hair or earring or two? I never forget your words, master. Nevertheless, I expect you to repay me for the extra ruby. Of course, uh, of course. What will you pay? Fresh water in your tank. It almost happened to me again. What? I was almost rich. I have Taji could have done it for me. What would you do with all this wealth? I would do things, have things. And where would you keep all these things? I'd keep it with me. It's a lot to ask your horse to carry. For you. I'd buy more horses to carry it all. Well, with all these new horses, you're going to have to buy some wagons to carry all the feed. Ten or so. Well, that's more like a herd. Now, add to the fact that you have to hire people to care for the horses and the wagons, Plus, you'll need a hunter to catch food. A couple of cooks to cook up the food the hunter catches. Before you know it, you're going to be broke. Is that what you think? I have nothing against people with no money. Do you? No, of course not. Then you've learned a valuable lesson. You know what it is? To like yourself for what you are. Poor. Good. It's not fair. Stop scowling. I'm not scowling. I am not... I just had this conversation with Ali. Oh, I know Ali likes to talk. But I can't figure out what I just learned. I think I agreed to be poor. How long? I guess my whole life. What do you mean, don't worry? I can eat and sleep. But what if I really want the finer things in life? Oh. So I won't have them. But what if I really, really want them? Oh, I'll come and see you. And what are you going to do about it? Oh, nothing. Uh -huh. You're as bad as Otley. At least I can hear his words. I'm not scowling!
There's my saddle over there. Now, if you're calling this rotting piece of leather and a sheepskin a saddle, you might say I'm improving its condition. You runt of an orc's litter. I'll improve your condition by knocking your ugly little head off your spiny little shoulders. You try, you stiff-legged bugbear, and you'll be doing a snake dance for real. I'll show you a snake dance. Kill each other later. I would like to reach Zolan in three or four days. Yeah, he can wait a day or two. If the Zolan shift and joins us, we'll find safety in his territory. We had venison left. A whole hind leg. We did, that's right. What happened to it? What'd he say? It's gone. I got that. How? I woke up. I was hungry. If you slept better, we'd eat better. It was mostly bone. A whole hind quarter? You could at least left a hoof. There's not enough room in your mouth for two feet. No. Can we at least go to Bear Gulf? There are very beautiful women there. <laughs> we go where Crom and the Sword lead us. And now, let's go. Mighty Urzath has lost his virgin bride to the savage barbarian, and you thought it would be so simple to persuade old Mithron to give you his daughter's hand in marriage. Now, how do you propose to empty the treasury and ransack the land? Ha! So much for an easy conquest. <laughs> Enough of your buzzard squawking! Oh, all of your plans. Swept away by a primitive barbarian, <laughs> a painted savage, or... Silence! Mock me no more! Adriana is mine. I want her back. Oh, and how do you expect to accomplish this? Cast a spell. Send this upstart Garth to the demon's pit. He is immune to my spells. How is that possible? When Garth was a youth, he decreed that no stag in the Forbidden Forest should ever be killed. Since then, he has been shielded from all spells by the mighty Antler God. I'll attack. I'll wipe him and his kind off the face of the earth. <laughs> that would be the death of your army. <laughs> because to reach Garth's stronghold, you have to go through a very narrow canyon passageway and your army would be slaughtered. <laughs> I warn you, old woman. I took away your sight. If you are ridiculing me, you will rue this day. A small group, led by the warrior who wields the sword of Atlantis, could sneak through. Yes. Yes. I have heard of the sword, handed down by the ancient kings. Who is this warrior? Conan the Sumerian. Why can't I do this myself? Because he is Conan, and you are not. Bring him here. 
<laughs> he won't come. Make him come! Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I smell sorcery in these woods. Conan, you are too superstitious. I have traveled safely through these woods many times. The way to Bear Gulf. The wrong way. What? Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Ja. Yeah. Ja. Ja. You're right, Conan. These woods do reek of sorcery. What did he say? He said we should get out of here. Thank him for his wisdom. The sign sent us to the right. Come on! Yeah! Good or evil signs. We are still alive. That must be good. <laughs> we'll follow the safe road. Yeah! Ha! Oh, well. Sumerian approaches. You should prepare a welcome for him. Consider it done. Now be gone. <laughs> Would you like more company? I am still a woman who remembers how to achieve the heights of pleasure. Be gone, you old witch. The sight of you sickens me. More. <laughs> <laughs> I have intercepted a spell cast by Yantona. You have the audacity to interrupt my work with shenanigans of a blind, useless old hag. She has drawn Conan to Yursath's castle. To Yursath's castle? Then he must travel through the Elven Forest. I know of no other route. We owe the old crone a debt. For once, Conan has taken the path which leads directly into my power. Is this the route you thought safe? Who knows where the other road would have led us. Is there no fairness? Do I not deserve success in this endeavor? Patience, Master. Patience. We will keep a close watch. There will be other opportunities. Patience. 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 I am running out of patience. So what? Yeah. What is a slime? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, disgusting. Yeah, uh, let's get out of here. Gods of thunder! This muck stinks! You smell the same as before. What do you say? There's only one thing that smells worse. What? The scent of death. Oh. Cha! <laughs> Come 
come with us. Oh. Warriors come this way. <laughs> Conan. Have no fear. I mean you no harm. I fear no man or beast. Which are you, Rizat? I am Ursath, lord of this province. Why did you bring us here? You think I summoned you? You arrived in my village of your own free will. I thought you would cooperate more if women showed you the way rather than soldiers. Sorcery brought me here. But this sword will take me away. When you hear what I have to say, you will not regret your visit to Ursaf. A few days ago, my bride was abducted. I will pay a hundred pieces of gold if you find her and bring her back to me. Find another bride, and it will be less trouble for both of us. Is not a beauty like that worth rescuing? Not to me. Perhaps the Sumerian would prefer swords made of hardened iron. How many men can you arm? Bring back my bride and I'll supply you with 100 swords. That would have put them in a Zolan. You will need that. I'm aware of that. Who took her? Garth, a savage who flies under the Antler God banner. Bring me his head, and I'll make it 200. 300? Three hundred swords could help raise an army. I know that. like these. Potions that have been concocted will take time to work. Good. Try to get everyone to drink the wine and find out where the girl is. The potion is strong. If you must quench your thirst, drink water. Of course. 
this donkey. some little people. <laughs> now what do we do? Yeah. Wake <laughs> up. <laughs> yeah. Wake up, you half-wit. Yeah. Wake up. <laughs> <laughs> please. Please. Not so loud. At the moment. Someone is shooting his horse inside my head. I will nail a horseshoe to your butt unless you tell us what you saw. Have you seen the girl? <sighs> you would not believe what I have seen. She kissed him. She kissed Garth? Yes. No. She didn't kiss him. She devoured him. Mm. She didn't devour him. She consumed him with her passions. I swear I saw flames. Then, Zevin, you wouldn't believe what happened. She jumped up, and with her long, naked legs wrapped round his waist, he took her into the tent. What happened next was... I passed out. If she's in love with the bandit, she will not want to come back. I'll bring her back. I gave him my word. Is it to protect me? Or to mark me as yours? <laughs> then I should have two bracelets. I'll do even better than that. I'll give you a slave. Me. Come on! Get out of here! 
Take the fastest horses and hunt this barbarian down. Find him and hold him for me. His death is mine! I'll follow personally and I'll cut him to pieces! I'll roast his teeth over the sacred fire. And wear them around my neck. Stop him. My horse is going lame. He can make a poultice and fix it. How long do you need? We can be riding before the sun crosses our shadows. Huh. Let's find shelter behind those rocks. Come on! Cha! Hello! Sooner or later, you will have to eat. I will feast at your funeral. Why did you not take guard when you had the chance? I have no argument with him. Why should I kill him? He will surely come after you. I know. And then? Crom will decide. Well, I only hope he's paying attention. If you will not eat, at least have some water. Are you trying to be kind or just concerned I will slow you down? Your thirst has already made that decision. You move like an animal. A great, powerful animal, but still an animal. When I was a small girl, I had a dream. It haunted me endlessly. A beast man would come and take me away. He would carry me to a place so far away, it could never be reached. You think I'm the beast man? You are taking me to Ursath, are you not? It is said Ursath was sired by a caco demon, raised and suckled by imps and succumbi. He made a pact with his father. He would be given sorcerer's secrets, mysteries of the dark universe. How did you know this? He will send you to your death. Your words are full of doom and threats. There was peace in my life once. My father was the Lord of Mirth, place of a hundred lakes, place of peace and prosperity. My father loved to fish in those lakes. He kept his nets very well mended, such as he did with his life. If it is so beautiful, you should have stayed. I had been promised to Garth, but Ursath coveted my father's lands. He cast a spell compelling my father to give him my hand in marriage. Garth rescued me. He loves me. And I him. What you are doing is wrong. We are not meant to be apart. Let me go. I can't. First chance I get, I will kill you. We will see about that.
Try harder. Uh. Hold, hold. I'm up. I'm alive. Get out the answer and ready. We have to move out of here now. It won't be so easy the next time. Easy? Is that your horse, Zevin? Is Conan part mountain goat that he cannot be trapped in the rocks? It seems as if he's a great deal more like a herd of bulls. And you seem to derive pleasure from his escape. He did not escape, Master. He was never caught in the first place. A play on words. Do not banter with me. Of course, O oh Great One. Is there anything else you desire of me? Well, good news would be a start. Should I want for a pleasant message before I appear again? Yes, it would be desirable. It could take a long time. Would you like some bird droppings in your water? Or will you be silent? <sighs> ah, so. You are learning some manners at last. <laughs> We will go in this direction, over the mountain. That will not stop Garth from following us. Garth will split the forces. Half will come after me, the others will follow you. I'll meet you later. Yes, an ambush. How can you be sure Garth will split his force? He will.
This is the track of the Sumerian. The horse went in this direction. Adraina is with them. Conan went up that mountain. Zygon takes six men. Captured the Sumerian. His death belongs to me. Going to kill? Kill. You lucky Sumerian. If the dagger was in my hand, you'd be dead. I got him. I got him. swords he will betray you find yourself rotting in a dungeon Garth is right herself is not to be trusted Conan their words ring of truth I will do what I promised to do welcome Conan you have done more than I asked you have brought back my beautiful bride and you have brought me the brigand Garth Alive. My part of the bargain is complete. That it is. I'm very pleased, Sumerian. Your swords are being prepared. Keep your swords. You lied to me. It was you who abducted Ariana. You separated what was not meant to be separated. How dare you speak to me with such insolence! No one can lie to me or can buy me. You want his head? Pay him!
You think he's not human? He's human enough for my sword! <laughs> I come. This time you got the right one. I'm sorry you didn't get your swords. Swords that turn into flowers serve no one. Not even a beast man. I am sorry I said that. You are not my beast man. Because of you, I was able to slay him. Ride with us. Share our journey. We each ride our own journeys. You enjoy your life. And you, woman. Under all that muscle is a big romantic heart. One day it will beat faster for a woman you want. There is no hope for both of us. This is a heart you try to put your dagger into. Thank you for making me fail. My pleasure. Oh. Maybe I will write with you. <laughs> <laughs> Not on your life. <laughs> <laughs>